Hello, KTA Tigers, and hello, Dr. Lesher. Hi, Ms. Tilly. Hello, everyone. Hi, welcome back. I hope everybody had a wonderful break. I hope everyone got some rest and did some fun things with your family and friends and just enjoy the nice, beautiful weather that we're finally having. So it's we're happy that we had a break and we're happy that everybody's back and safe and sound and ready to start the second quarter. Yes, for sure. So today is Tuesday, October 12th, 2021. Great day at KTA and a great start to second quarter. So we are continuing to celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month. We have um, some more reports to share from Ms. Malin's class. This one is from Ismahan and they wrote about Ava Perón. So she was the first lady of Argentina. That's part of why she was famous. Before that, she was an actress um, before she became the first lady. She helped to um, shape the freedom of the people of Argentina and was very instrumental in setting up lots and lots of different charities within her country. Um, she had a major influence on um, everything related to her country at that time. So she was born in 1919 and um, became uh, an actress soon after that, soon after, when she was very, very young at the age of 15, and then started her own business before becoming um, the First Lady of Argentina. So the quote that Ismahan had picked out that she really liked from Ava Perón was that one cannot accomplish anything without action and that time was, is my greatest enemy. Those were the two quotes that she picked. So she had so many things that she wanted to do, so many ways that she wanted to help and contribute to her country, but just not all the time in the world to do that. So we, I understand that very much. Well, thank you so much, Ishmahan, and um, thank you to Ms. Malin's class. We will have a different person to feature for you tomorrow. I'm really enjoying these different stories and reports. Well, Ms. Tilly and everyone, we are very excited to celebrate uh, two of our fabulous staff members here at KTA. Uh, that is our superintendent, Mrs. Tenez, on the right, and she is presenting Ms. Color with a special certificate where uh, acknowledging the hard work and dedication that Ms. Color uh, is showing to our whole school and to everyone. And we also were able to have Mrs. Tenez recognize Mrs. Oxenhandler for her hard work and dedication and all the help that she's given us with technology. So we are so proud of Ms. Color and Mrs. Oxenhandler. And I think we have some uh, photos and a video to share about that. Yes, we do. Here it is.
technology helps with tools and duty of men. She was able to manage technology distribution and collect the machine to ensure that the school resources were protected while making sure students had the materials they needed to both flex and in person learning. In the 21 22 school year, she's newly learned skills and started over as she continues to be a valuable resource in ABA. And like last year, her job is never changed this year. I am sure that is true. But thank you. Um, she may be asked to provide classroom or duty coverage and support notice, and then be asked if she appears in trouble with the projector of math system. She is able to quickly take tasks and do whatever is presented to help out. Whenever she is presented with new and unique challenges, she is resourceful and she can get assistance with others throughout the district by collaborating and And how much fun was that that for Mrs. Oxenhandler, all the students were there to help celebrate? Yes, it was a really fun day that day. We we enjoyed it. So congratulations, congratulations. again. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. All right. I think let's see that it is going to be time to start our day and start our second quarter in the very best way we can. So um, I have your moment of inspiration coming up from our multimedia students. After that, you will see your Tiger Pledge followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. So make it a great day, KTA. Go happy quarter two. Yay, happy quarter two.